what's up everybody welcome back to another video today we're here to do my nfl week 18 picks the last week of regular season football man it's kind of sad this season goes by so fast man disappointing but hey i'm excited for the last week of football and of course the nfl playoffs are good as always um a lot of teams still trying to get in the playoffs a lot of teams trying to win a division we have some good matchups this week good good matchup this weekend today saturday and tomorrow obviously tomorrow sunday um, but yeah, and we got the college um, championship on Monday, Michigan and Washington. Go Washington, by the way. Um, but yeah, it obviously it sucks as a Broncos fan. My team's out of the playoffs for the eighth year in a row. But hey, still going to enjoy football. Still going to enjoy football. Some good matchups next couple of days, like I said. And you got the college championship on Monday with Michigan, Washington. So yeah, we got some good football coming up, man. Football's the best sport in the freaking world. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Um, today we have some good matchups. Um, you know, Steelers, Ravens, Colts, and Texans should be some good matchups today. This week, there's a lot of backup quarterbacks starting for the Ravens. I think it's Huntley, Taylor, or not Taylor, Tyler Huntley is starting for the Ravens. And obviously, you got Mason Rudolph. There's just a lot of backups starting this week. Some teams already clinched. Some teams are just resting the starters, you know. So it should be a, it could be a wild weekend. It could be a wild um, couple days of football, some upsets. You never know what could happen in the NFL. But, okay, so the Steelers, are they have like a 30% chance to get in the playoffs. They're trying to get in. Um, they need some help, too. They need, I think they need the Bills, to lo- the Bills to lose or something like that. And then Jaguars maybe to lose. I'm not sure. There's, there's so many scenarios right now and then the playoffs. So well, I'm just not going to worry about that. I'm just going to watch the games, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, it should be good. You know, so many scenarios going on right now. So many teams can get in. Some teams can fall out. Um, the bill, the Bills could actually fall out. That's crazy. The Bills can go. If they lose the game, they could potentially lose, miss the playoffs. I saw like what? It's just so many weird scenarios right now for the playoffs. Um, but yeah, Steelers need to win this damn game if they want to get in the playoffs. Um, I'm going the Ravens. I'm going Ravens and Baltimore. I know Steelers could win this. I, I could be very wrong, but I think Huntley. It can get the job done. I think Huntley and the Ravens can get the job done. Um, this is this is a very interesting game. You got the Colts and Texans. Basically, the winner goes to the playoffs, and the loser is eliminated from the playoffs. So, yeah, AFC South showdown here. Colts, Texans. This can go either way, man. This can go either way, but I'm going with Houston. CJ Stroud is coming back. CJ Stroud is coming back. They're getting some guys healthy. At the right time now here, week 18. Um, Colts, they had a really good year, but I think their season ends here. I think Texans will go into Indy and beat the Colts. Man, I won't be surprised if Gardner Menju wins this game or the Colts win this game, but I'm going with, I'm going with Houston in this game. Um, Jack, Jets and Patriots, I'm going with the Patriots. Until proven otherwise, man, the, the Patriots own the damn Jets. The Patriots own the Jets. Until I'm proven otherwise, I'm I'm picking New England against them because the Jets have not beat New England. God, I think it's been a long time, so I'm going with the Patriots there. I know they're trying to tank and all this bullshit, but fucking Jets haven't beat them in like I can't remember the last time they beat them. It's been <laughs> it's been so long. It's one of the biggest like like winning streaks against teams. It's been a long time. Um, Cleveland and Cincinnati. I'm going Cleveland. Um, Jaguars and Titans, I'm going with the Jaguars. I think the Jaguars, I think if they win this game, they win the AFC South, I think. If they lose, though, it could be really interesting what happens. Jaguars are not playing really good right now. Trevor Lawrence, I think, is questionable. I don't know. Tennessee could win that, honestly. Um, Chiefs and Chargers, I'm going with the Chiefs, even though it's going to be the backup quarterback. Mahomes is not playing. Chargers are so fucking bad, though. I'm, I'm going with the Chiefs. Broncos Raiders, you know, I want to beat this team. I'm I'm going Broncos. I'm going with the Broncos here to beat the Chiefs. I'm going with the Broncos here to beat the Chiefs. Oh not Chiefs. What am I saying? What am I fucking saying? Why is it picking Raiders too? Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? There it is. I don't know why I said Chiefs. I'm Broncos to beat the Raiders here. Um Broncos have not beat the, the Raiders and since what, like 2019? It's been like fucking four and five years. It's been ridiculous. It's time to beat the Raiders. Josh Jacobs is out. 
I mean, I'm not really convinced by Aiden O'Connell. I mean, you cannot lose to Aiden O'Connell. I know, I mean, week one, we lost to Jimmy G, so, I mean, they ain't really saying much. But, you know, we could have fucking won that game if fucking Will Lutz made the damn kicks, and you know. I don't know, man. I, I really, I think the Broncos will win. I think we will. I think we will end the streak against the Raiders finally. And then, you know, we finish 9-8. and eight, be pretty subpar season. Obviously not where we want to be. But I do have hope for the future for this Broncos team. We'll see what they do in the draft, quarterback position, other needs on this team. We'll see. But I'm going with the Broncos. I feel like we have, I think we have a good chance in this, in this game. It's, I know I know we haven't won in Vegas, but I think I think we can beat Vegas. We're, there's gonna be a, there's gonna be more Bronco fans there in Vegas than there are um, Raider fans. So we're gonna invade Ve- um, Vegas with the fans. The, the very match, very good matchup here. You got Bills and Dolphins. Like I said, the winner wins the NF or AFC East. It's gonna be a very good game. I'm going Miami. I'm going Miami. Um, I know Buffalo is really red hot right now. I know Buffalo is red hot, but I'm going with Miami in this. I'm I, I, I'm gonna go with Miami. I'm going with their playmakers. I'm going with Miami. It's in Miami. Um, I know Tua and the Dolphins have not played well against good teams this year, um, but I think they can beat them. I think the Do- Dolphins are gonna come out red hot. Hill, um, you know, you got fucking Waddle, and yeah, obviously you got some good running backs there. Um, the defense still gotta play better though. That defense gotta play better for the freaking Dolphins. We'll see what Josh Allen does. I don't know if you can trust Josh Allen in the big moments. I don't know. Um, oh my God, some some of these matchups don't mean nothing. I'm going Buccaneers, Panthers. Going Buccaneers. I think Buccaneers. Oh, if the Buccaneers win this game, I think they win the NFC South. NFC South is so fucking bad. But yeah, I think the Buccaneers win the division if they beat the Panthers. So there you go. And then you got the Vikings and Lions. I'm going with the Lions. Lions or the the Vikings season is pretty much done. They just not go anywhere. They don't have a quarterback. Nick Mullen sucks. Jared Hall sucks. Obviously, Josh Dobbs is not that good anymore. It's they're done, man. The Vikings are done pretty much. Um, Falcons and Saints. I'm going to Saints. Cowboys Commanders. I'm going to Cowboys. I think that if the Cowboys win this game, they win the NFC East. So looks like Cowboys will probably win the NFC East after the Eagles lost to the Cardinals last week in an embarrassment. The Eagles did not look good. Eagles, Giants, I'm going to the Eagles. And it doesn't even matter if the Eagles win. The, 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 I think the Cowboys have the uh, better record. I guess they have the better conference record or something like that. They have the better record overall. Um, I think it's a conference record or in division record. I'm not really sure what it's called. Um, but the Cowboys do have the better um, record. So that, that it, it don't matter if the Cowboys win, Eagles win. Cowboys had the better record in the conference, I think. So that makes them the be- you know, that makes them the champions. They went into the NFC East. Um, like Eagles just not been looking good like really though. They've not been looking good. I don't know what it is. Um, I think they beat the Giants though. Giants they, they the Giants really struggle to beat the Eagles. That's one team the Giants just cannot really beat. The Eagles or Cowboys really. But they do the the Giants own Washington. Um, Bears, Packers, I'm going with the Packers. Packers got to keep winning if they want to make the playoffs. Um, Seahawks, Cardinals, going to Seahawks. Seahawks also trying to get in the, in the wild card race. I know the Rams clinched. Here, yeah, speaking of the Rams, here they go. Yeah, um, Niners and Rams, I think Stafford and Purdy are not playing. Uh, it's battle of backups. I'm gonna, I guess I'll go to the Niners. Um, but yeah. There's my week 18 picks. It's a lot of these games could go either way because, you know, a lot of backup quarterbacks are playing this week and, you know, anything can happen in the NFL. Should be an interesting week of football, man. Should be an interesting week of football. Um yeah, let me know your thoughts down below. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel and comment down below your week 18 picks down below in the comment section below. And I hope you guys have a good night. And yeah, should be a good weekend of football um, today, tomorrow, and like I said, Monday, the college championship, Michigan and Washington, go Washington. Um, But yeah, thank you guys for watching. As always, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and comment down below your picks down below. And hope you guys have a good night, guys. Peace out. Hope you guys have a good one. Peace. Goodbye. Have a good one.